Hey guys, Jordy here, and today I'll be showing you the new Halloween boss. This boss will be around from today until the 1st of November, I believe, and uh, it drops a few epics, rings, helm, and uh, a mount, as usual. You ready, man? Now those of you that are familiar with this boss or have been playing for more than a year will know it's quite a boring fight to be honest. Uh, basically all you do is summon the boss by right clicking on the pumpkin, he comes out, flies around and you, it's pretty much just a DPS race to get it down. It's not really a race, you just kind of save your time. Uh, during the fight he laughs quite a lot. Which gets a bit irritating. Says a lot of quotes which rhyme like a poet and um, doesn't really do all that much damage. As you can see throughout the whole video, I pretty much spammed announce, which is a Holy Pally DPS esque move. Um, yeah, as a Holy Pally, all I've really done is put Sacred Shield, sorry, and uh, top up the group with Holy Shock and maybe uh, Holy Radiance and stuff. But basically, just kill the boss. When you do kill the boss, the head and the body will be separated. When the head and body are separated, you run after the head as a group and get it down about half of its health, and then return back to the fight. Get over here, you idiot. As you can see, our group follows the head and DPS is down as much as possible. The key to this whole fight is to actually kill the head, however, after a while they'll rejoin, heal the boss up back to full 7.5 million health, I think it was. He'll ride around again and you kind of just DPS him down. It's really quite simple. And, um, yeah. Again, it's a really easy and boring fight. All you need to do is DPS the boss until the head becomes separated, DPS the head as much as possible, and come back onto the boss until the head's separated again. When the head does die, however, the boss will explode and die. Um, another thing to mention is when he gets low on health, he summons some pumpkin soldiers, which really don't do that much damage. Uh, have the tank just AoE them and uh, keep their threat to kill the boss, so really nothing to worry about. So yeah, that's pretty much the fight. Uh, congratulations to anyone who gets it down. I'll be quite worried if you don't. As you can see there, I do get my epic ring, which is a huge upgrade for me as I'm still running a few normal blues and heroic blues. So an epic's quite nice. Uh, my tank friend got the one-handed sword and I got um, the little blue helmet from my um, bag, which I don't think I show on camera. But yeah, that's pretty much the fight. If you guys have any questions at all, which I doubt you should because this fight's pretty self-explanatory, feel free to message me either in-game, uh, my name is Jordash on Kazgrov, and or um, PM me or comment on YouTube and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Thanks guys, make sure to subscribe.